about human settlements um, is basically coming in as a second leg. Um, you know that in disasters, disaster comes in, we put people in shelters. Unfortunately, we experienced some delays in terms of the temporary relocation area that we have identified to put them in. Uh, the relocation area is in Denver, and um, what we have done now, um, with the assistance of home affairs, because unfortunately, as it speaks to um, foreign nationals, we are directed by home affairs. We as humans have no, we don't deal with immigration laws. That's a fact. So, in terms of our policies, we get directed by home affairs in terms of who is a, is a beneficiary who qualifies as it speaks to foreign nationals. So what we've done, what you see there behind me, is uh, we've got a bus and a truck where we have loaded the belongings and the people, the beneficiaries that we are relocating to at the Denver um, TRD. So what you see today is a relocation and we've got Home Affairs here to deal with the other aspects and Home Affairs, I'm sure um, we'll give them the opportunity to speak in terms of what they are doing. Thank you. Just, uh, is it only South Africans then that will be going to the Denver uh, service shelter? We've got South Africans and we've got one naturalized South African. So there is a foreign national who is legally in the country in terms of our, of our policies and we are obligated because this is a naturalized South African. In, in, so in principle, naturalized as a South African. I understand. If you, if you find someone who's not naturalized but they're here on legal papers, what would you do with them? Home Affairs will speak to that. Yeah. So this is even, where is Denver and what kind of place is it? Like another shelter or what kind of place? It's a, it's, a, it's a transitional relocation area. Um, we're linking it up with UISP. It's next to, to the Denver informal settlement. Uh, sorry, uh, you mentioned there was a delay. Um, can you just speak about what, what was the cause of the delay and maybe some of the challenges you faced finding accommodation? Like uh, I can't speak to the de detail of the delays, but. Uh, Various aspects, such as identifying the site, number one, number two, uh, the weather, the heavy storms that we had, also delayed the construction of the buildings. Colleagues, we need to make way there's a party that must come out. Yeah.